Do you ever just wish that instead of trying to find the perfect shampoo and conditioner for your hair, that you could just talk to the chemists who make this stuff and tell them exactly what you need? Welcome back to my channel, and if you're brand new here, hi, my name's Courtney, and I love using tips and tricks from the Curly Girl Method to improve the health of my hair. I get kind of sciencey and nerdy over here. I love talking about hair care and hair care ingredients. If you would, please subscribe and click that notification bell so that you'll be notified when I upload again. And if you find this video helpful, I would really appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. It does help me out and it lets me know that the video accomplished its purpose in being helpful. And if you want to, feel free to share this video with your friends if it was helpful to you. But today, we are talking about a really neat company. We're talking all about Formulate. By this time, I'm pretty sure we have all seen slash heard about different companies that make specific shampoos and conditioners for you. You can even pick the color and the smell and all that fun stuff and they'll write your name on the bottle for you. Like we've all seen these companies before. And I'm not gonna lie, I have been sorely tempted to try them, but I always had a bit of a hesitation in wanting to try some of these different shampoos that are customizable. And the main reason was that I would take their online quiz and I really felt like they were putting me into a box. They weren't actually making the shampoo for me. They were trying to figure out which one of their shampoos they had already made would work for me. It wasn't a shampoo actually made for me. They were figuring out which one of their shampoos would maybe kind of sort of fit my hair. Well, along came Formulate. They reached out to me and I started researching them and I went, uh-huh, another one of these companies that is going to make customizable shampoos. Great, awesome, wrong. <laughs> I actually got a chance to talk to the team over at Formulate and their approach is completely different. They allow the consumer to communicate directly with the chemist that formulates each and every single shampoo and conditioner they make. Guys, I tell you, I absolutely grilled the poor people over at Formulate, really digging into their process. And turns out they actually single batch make each shampoo and conditioner. Their system will allow them to formulate ingredients down to the 100th of a percent. So each formula truly is customized to each consumer. That absolutely blew my mind. I have no idea how they make that work, but guys, they did it. Also, they have an app that allows you to manage your entire formulate experience. And I know that sounds a little silly, but what I mean by that is, is this is kind of a subscription service. So you can check in and see when your next subscription is going to ship out. You can also directly communicate with the chemist that you were assigned to that formulated your specific shampoo and give them direct feedback on what worked for you and what didn't. You can change the scent. Yes, you're allowed to pick your scent on this and change it if you feel like trying something new. They even allow you to increase the strength of the scent or decrease the strength of the scent. If you want a light fragrance or a medium fragrance or a strong fragrance, they have six different options for fragrance, which I feel like is very generous. I will mention that some of the raw ingredients that they use in their formulas don't have the most pleasant smell. They're not using products that have been bleached and super treated, so some of them have a stronger smell. And I did pick 
the sweet orange scent and I picked light and I will say that it wasn't quite enough to help neutralize some of those stronger odors of those raw ingredients. So I did switch it to the green with envy, the green tea scent, which I'm real excited to use. So there is that they're all natural scents may not be able to fully neutralize that raw ingredients that they use in their formulas. If you do pick the natural fragrance, you might want to bump it up a bit because I did find that it was a very, very light touch of orange fragrance. The smell of the raw ingredients doesn't linger in my hair. It's not an issue, but I do notice it when I'm washing my hair. Not a big deal. Something that I can easily customize for my next shipment. For me, they allowed me to address my hair concerns and I'm actually going to open up my Formulate app and show you exactly what it looks like. So this is my Formulate app. You can absolutely see what my team is. Sweet Tammy is the chemist that has been helping me out with my formula. They just added the debrassing dye, which is kind of exciting if you have Blonde highlights, you can manage so much here. You have chat with support, 24 hour support, which is really fun. You can also invite a friend. They have a really neat referral program, which I appreciate. And you can manage your products. I just changed my scent to green with Envy. I'm kind of excited about that. But here you can really see my hair's goals and they have a lot of bullet points. I chose strengthen, hydration, curl definition, oil control, cause y'all know I'm greasy. <laughs> and I chose glossy hair. Those are my personal goals and I can go in there and change those at any time. These are all the different goals that you can choose when customizing your hair care. They do allow you to pick six to kind of help narrow it down, but I have found that I have noticed a lot of these benefits even without picking them. For example, no split ends. I don't have any of those. <laughs> um, I have noticed more volume with these products and I have absolutely zero frizz when I use these products as well. So that is really awesome. You can also tell them if you have any restrictions. I didn't pick non-vegan. I sleep on a silk pillowcase. I'm not vegan. Um, I did mean, I did tell them that I was 100% silicone free. I do not have a gluten allergy, but if you do, you can tell them and they will make your products gluten free. They also have nut allergy, which I thought was really, really cool. So if you really need your products to be catered to your specific allergies, they can do that. They get that specific. And if you want, you can click on more down here and you can even see your exact formulas. And y'all know that Nerdy Courtney absolutely loved getting to see the breakdown of every single ingredient in the hair care. You can click the little details. My camera died and I forgot where I was. So editing Courtney is probably going to be screaming at me right now, but Basically, you can look at each ingredient in your formula and figure out exactly what each ingredient is. I really appreciate that because I'm kind of nerdy and I love researching ingredients. I actually feel like this experience has taught me more about the ingredients in my hair care. So there's that. Formulate's whole mission is to create an absolutely 100% actually customized hair care regimen for you. In talking to the sweet people over at Formulate, I did pick their brain a bit and they are looking to expand in the future to include stylers, then branch out into skincare. Gotta love little visitors. <laughs> but they are looking to branch out and expand and eventually the thought process is, is that your entire personal care system will be housed in the Formulate family and in the Formulate app. So you can customize your toothpaste and your deodorant and your skincare and everything. They will eventually be able to connect the consumer to the formulator on many more things than just shampoo and conditioner. But I've got to say, they really, 
really nailed the shampoo and conditioner. I used to think that shampoo and conditioner really didn't make that big a difference in how my hair turned out, that it was really my application and my stylers that made the biggest difference in how my hair turned out. And I've got to say, I've noticed a big difference when I do use Formulate versus when I am using, let's say, a lower end drugstore sort of formula. Yes, I have tried some of those recently on my channel and they're good, but well, one of them was really nice and one of them was not made for my hair. And Formulate is just made for your hair. It takes out all the guesswork, which I really appreciate. Bonus, the entire line is sulfate free and they are paraben free and preservative free. Because they are batch making each of these, they don't have to use the strong preservatives to calculate in that time that the product's gonna need to sit in the warehouse and then sit on the shelves at the grocery store or in the salon before you come pick them up. So they can make their products cleaner in the sense that they aren't having to use parabens or preservatives in their formulas. Also, super fun. The sweet, sweet people over at Formulate offered to sponsor a giveaway here on this channel. And you know what? Since we just hit 50,000 subscribers, I'm gonna call it a 50,000 subscriber giveaway celebration so all you have to do in order to enter is click on the link in the description down below and it will take you to my formulate giveaway page. You just log in there and get to work. You will be giving your name and your email address. It's all 100% confidential on the formulate website. And guess what? When you do that, you automatically get a $5 off coupon code for formulate. So even if you don't win the giveaway, you will still have a $5 off coupon, which is nice. <laughs> but enough of me rambling. I'll go ahead and take y'all into my bathroom with me and I'll wash my hair and show you exactly what I did to my hair today. Let's go take a look. See, shall we? Hey there guys. All right. We are here yet again over my tub and this will be a fairly quick wash routine because there will be no stylers as Formulate has no stylers yet for me to show you how I use them. <laughs> anyway, I'm just going in with their shampoo that is completely personalized for me. I actually enjoy the texture of this shampoo. It's not too thick and not too runny, really nice medium consistency. And I have found that I actually use the exact same amount of the shampoo as I do the conditioner. I use three pumps of the shampoo and three pumps of the conditioner. The shampoo lathers beautifully, and for an extra good scalp scrub today, I am going in with my lovely little scalp scrubber. I love this thing. It's very affordable on Amazon, and it feels so good, but while I'm scrubbing my scalp, I just thought I'd also talk about how fun the shape of the bottles is. They're kind of a hexagon shape, which that is very cool and unusual. I approve. I enjoyed it. All right, now that my scalp is nice and clean and thoroughly cleansed, I'm just going to rinse all that shampoo out of my hair. I always keep scrubbing my scalp a bit while I'm rinsing out shampoo. I find that it really helps get my scalp clean. Now I'm going in with the Formulate Conditioner. This is the personalized conditioner for me. Woohoo! Gotta love it. Three pumps. And again, another really nice consistency on this product. Not too thick, not too thin. I find that when products are too thin, I tend to drop them all over the shower. And when they're too thick, I have trouble distributing them through my hair. So I enjoy the consistency of these. Now that my hair is well and thoroughly finger detangled, I'm just going to finish working that conditioner through every strand of my hair with my Perfect Hair Care brush. This is very similar to the wet brush. It has very bendy bristles, doesn't damage my hair, which is lovely. 
All right, so now that that is well worked into my hair, I am going to add just the smidgenest bit of water to my hair and do a good thorough squish to condition. This is something that I do with every conditioner that I use, and I find that it really helps give my hair time to penetrate or absorb. There we go. It gives the conditioner time to penetrate and gives my hair time to absorb the conditionery goodness. And adding just that tiniest bit of water helps with that hydration factor because water equals hydration. Now I'm just raking the hair off the back of my head and squishing both sides of my head. Great. Did that. Thoroughly hydrated. Now it's time to rinse all that conditioner out. This one is formulated hot, 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 to be completely rinsed out. So I didn't leave any of the conditioner in my hair. Now that I am styling my hair kind of straight. I'm going to put on my perfect hair care towel, but I'm going to let the lengths of my hair fall into the towel and I'm just going to wrap that up and let that sit for a minute. Yay for product-free wash days. All right, so I have let this towel sit on my head for mm, 10 minutes or so and now I'm ready to take it down and just let it air dry. I am still amazed at how much water these towels soak up. Now there is a little bit of a trick to this. The trick for me is you can see that everything is kind of like stuck, like it doesn't want to fall down. And if I were to let it dry like this, I might look like something that wash, washed up on the beach. Not in a good way. <laughs> So what I like to do is my hair is damp, but because that conditioner is so good, my hair still has a ton of slip. So I'm just kind of brushing everything a little bit. I'm going to have to bend down really far. All right. And you can see now everything is less stuck. There's some stuck stuff here. And there's some stuck stuff here. I'm gonna give my head a bit of a shake and see if that'll break up and come unstuck. There we go. So now I'm just gonna kind of finish getting everything going exactly the way, the direction I want it to go. So when I brush my hair upside down first, it averts any potential tangles so that when I kind of flip my head over, give it a bit of shake, I can then brush it again right side up. If I were to just stand right side up and immediately start trying to brush my hair, I think that would be a super tangled mess. So now I'm just gonna kind of gently point the hair in the direction that I want it to go. Basically away from my face. Don't touch me hair. Na 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 na, can't touch this. I'm the cool mom, can you tell? All right, so I've got my hair smoothed down. You can see that it is nearly completely straight. Like I'm gonna try and keep it really smooth and really, really like straight. I'm not gonna go sit on the couch and let it get all bunched up and weird. I'm not gonna scrunch it. While it's air drying, I will occasionally keep running my fingers through it just to ensure that everything is staying nice and smooth. I have parted my hair on the wrong side or the opposite side to what I normally do so that when I flip it back over, there might be just a, a little bit of volume. I really struggle with volume when I air dry. So this has been helpful to me in the past. Um, if you have a tighter curl pattern than I do or coarser hair that just isn't so easily weighed down by the weight of the water, my fine hair, like the weight of the water will pull my hair straight. So if your hair is a little bit coarser and the weight of the water isn't enough to weigh it down, something you could do is just kind of keep twisting your hair into, I have so many layers, I don't think this would work for me either. But if you have less layers and coarser hair, you can keep twisting your hair into two big chunks to kind of keep it smooth and let it air dry like so. 
The, the twists will just kind of fall out, but that is something you can do. I have seen people with coarser hair do that. Air dry their hair product free with great success that way. But enough rambling, enough chit chatting. I will let my hair air dry and I will be back to show you the finished final air dry results. And I'm back. This is my hair 100% air dried. Why? Why though? <laughs> See, mostly straight with a bend at the end. Gotta love wavy hair. But now that it's 100% dry, let me just turn around and show you the back. Oh, and now I can flip my part to the other side now that it's completely dry. And hopefully those pieces that were sticking out all crazy will now fold in. And see, now I have more volume. But there you have it guys. You can absolutely see how soft, can you really see softness? But I promise my hair feels like it looks right now. It's really soft, it is very shiny. I swear after my last haircut, more waves are starting to show up. Even on my product-free air-dried hair. Yay for a good haircut. But my hair is very clean and very soft and y'all tell me. Shiny? But there you have it guys. This is my hair with absolutely nothing else in it other than my Formulate Shampoo and Conditioner. I have used these products with stylers and they play so well with every set of stylers I've used with them. And I also find that this is unusual. Usually when I wash and condition my hair and air dry product free, I find that if I don't put in a leave-in, my hair is really dry and Sometimes when I put in that leave-in, my hair then feels slightly weighed down. So first off, my hair doesn't feel like it needs a leave-in right now. It feels very soft and hydrated and like tangle-free. The leave-in helps with my tangles sometimes. And bonus, my hair doesn't feel weighed down. So there you go. All right, guys, that is it for this video. The only products in my hair right now are the Formulate products. I tell you what, when I haven't felt like doing my hair lately, but I really want to have my hair look super extra nice with minimal effort, I have absolutely been reaching for and grabbing the Formulate products. Good luck to everyone who enters the giveaway. If you don't win, don't worry, there will be more giveaways on this channel in the future. But that being said, I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day and I will talk to y'all later. Bye!